In this video, we will learn about how we can get top subcategories per category. So here you can see uh, we have uh, product categories and then we have product subcategories and uh, here the third column will contain the total number of uh, products per subcategory and we need to know the top two subcategories per category. In the above picture, you can see we have one category bikes and bikes contain three subcategories. And uh, these are the uh, different number of uh, products that are available in this uh, subcategory. And uh, we need to display top two subcategory for each category. For this product bikes, we should display like road bikes. This is the topmost because this category contains uh, highest amount of products and then the second will be mountain bikes and in the same way in the components and all the other categories that are available in the data set in the below image you can see the required output so we need to display the categories and then for each category we need to display top two subcategories for like for the pies, these are the top two subcategory for the component, clothing, accessories. So for all the available categories, we need to display top two subcategories. And uh, the subcategory should be based on the total number of uh, products available for that subcategory. So let's go to the Power Query Editor. For this example, we need product category, subcategory and product table. Let's combine these three tables with each other so we need to click on the merge query merge query as new product category and then we need product subcategories this is the primary key and this one is the foreign key then we need inner join okay and uh, here we can rename categories subcategories here you can see one table that contains the information about the product subcategories so we can remove the unnecessary columns and I'll try to add product now we need to join with the product table Again, merge query as new. Sorry, before merging, we need uh, subcategory keys. For this, we have to take a product subcategory key and uh, the English product subcategory name. Here we can write subcategories and now try to merge as a new. products and we need product subcategory product subcategory and inner join okay and uh, this will be the final table so top subcategory this is the name of the table so now we have um, product category and we don't need uh, this column and we have a product subcategory and this is the table that contains the product information and uh, from the product table we are interested only in the product key so we need to add uh, one column here add column the product product underscore key and here we have to write select column table dot select column so it needs the table the table name is products and uh, then we are interested in the column product key That's it. Click OK. 
so here you can see we are getting the product key column and now we need to count the number of uh, products for each subcategory so we can do with with the same step go to the let's go to the setting and uh, here we have to add one more function row count table dot row count that's it click ok so uh, here we got the number of uh, products for every subcategory like a mountain bikes we have 38 road bikes we have 65 cabs we have three so we can uh, delete this column okay so now we have category subcategory and the product key and uh, now we need grouping grouping on english product category so we need to click group by and here we need english product category name and uh, we need all the rows against each category so we need to click ok and here you can see bikes components clothing and accessories and uh, this column count this column contains a subcategory and product key and if you click at the component so here you can see we are getting let me zoom it so here you can see we are getting 14 3 1 then 40 so how we can get the top products first we need to sort this table and uh, once it will be sorted then we can get the top two or three or any number that you, you want so now we need to sort this table every table we need to sort and uh, so how we can do that we need to add one more column add column and uh, custom column and here we have to add product table this is the name of the column and uh, we need here sort table dot sort and uh, the name of the table is is a count so this is the name of the table which column we need to sort this so it will be i think custom that's it click ok it's a product underscore key product underscore key so here you can see if i click here it is uh, order in ascending order right everything is in ascending and we need to do uh, this order by descending so let's go to the setting and here if i try to add the third parameter it is not possible because uh, the table dot sort only need two parameters the first parameter is the table and the other parameter is the criteria so we have to use here as a list and uh, first one is the product key and the second one will be the uh, the criteria it's so order function order dot descending this one and close the curly bracket so well, now we need to click ok so here you can see 65 38 22 and then the for the components it is 70 40 18 and so on so now we are able to sort every table and uh, now the next function is we need to get the top two records 
So how we can do that? We need to add one more column, custom column, and it is a first table dot first n. This is the function, and it takes the first parameter is a table. This is the product table, and then we need that how many rows do we need? So this is the first two rows. Close it. Okay. And here you can see for the components, we are getting 6538. And for, sorry, for the bikes, we are getting 6538. For the components, we are getting 7040. And uh, if you look at the product table, so here you can see 70, 40. And in the clothing, we have 16 and 9. And if I click here, the new column is 16 and 9. So now the requirements is almost uh, fulfilled. So what we need now, we need to remove this column, the product table, and uh, we need to expand. And in this column, we need subcategory and the product key this is subcategory and here is you can rename it like uh, product count so for the bikes we are getting road bikes mountain bikes and the total number of products are 65 and 38 and the same way component road frames mountain frames so this is the way we can get top products by sale or top products by count we can do anything what we need so you can use the same approach so if you like this video please subscribe our channel and if you have any question please write in the comment section thank you